It's also known as the Muja Adong Wu Yuan. So wait, oh my god, check this out. Hippos. I'm sorry, Kai. I actually feel like I'm in the wild right now. Welcome to the panda store. Is he pooping? <laughs> here in Taipei. I'll be here for three days. That means three different large adventures. And today's adventure is gonna be one really, really fun. Something that I'm super excited for. Today we are at the Taipei Zoo. It's also known as the Mu Jia Dong Wu Yuan. This place I heard is awesome and it's full of animals. And I love animals. It's got pandas, it's got just lots of things in here and I'm really excited to take you guys. So we're going to go get some tickets in just a second. We're going to enter, and I am hoping that we can find my favorite animal, which you may just have to guess until the very end of the video if we find it. So we're going to be heading in. I am so excited for the zoo experience with you guys. So uh, let's go. The exciting time of our trip adventure here in the zoo has finally came. Right now we are in the panda house, the place where they have the pandas. And I am just so excited for this, as well as everyone else here. The people here, they love pandas. And I'm just so excited to see them. There are a few pandas in here, and actually there's one of them, which is the first panda that was ever born here in Taiwan. So wait, oh my gosh, check this out. That is so cool. Okay, I'm going to get to the front of this line and we can get a better view of it. Look! Look! The panda's butt! Whoa, look at that. Welcome to the panda store, where everything is panda. <laughs> Okay, so so far the zoo experience has been pretty good. It's been raining a lot, so that's been hindering some of our traveling, as well as there's crowds and crowds of people. I came here over the Zhongqiu Jie, the mid-autumn festival break, and man, ren hai, ren shan, ren shan, ren hai. Whatever, there's just a lot of people, and it's just crowded. But uh, we are now headed into a section, it's called the Rainforest Walk, the, this. This part, yeah, we're going there. So it's going to be an adventure and uh, maybe we'll see a few snakes. I think it's a hippo. Where? Man! Apparently there's hippos. Oh, oh my gosh. Hippos! Look! Come on camera. Get them. Oh my gosh. Hippos. Hippos! So far there hasn't been too many animals, and the ones I have seen have been sleeping, but the thing I love about this zoo is how they built it. It's designed nice and it's very beautiful. I mean, I'm walking on this cool little bridge. Like, woo! This is, oh, is there an animal over here? But, yeah, it's a very beautiful place. I absolutely like it. Look at that beast. But yeah, I actually feel like I'm in the wild right now. Is he pooping? Hey, you want to go play with the hama? With the hippos? Yeah. <laughs> Take 
not be in. Oh my gosh. Why is it that every animal I am taking videos of starts to take a poop? <laughs> and also, all these Taiwanese people, they love just to talk about all the feces that are on the ground from these animals. Pretty fun. Okay, so actually this zoo really isn't too big. There's this map right here I'll show you. And it's basically from the entrance right there, um, kind of up to the top. We are in the middle, and we were just right over here seeing all the other animals. So, it's not really too big, but it's also right next to the big city, so I don't really blame it for being that. It's also loaded with animals, though. When we went to the other one, it was animal after animal, all just packed next to each other, which just make it very convenient and quick to see all these animals. Kai, hey! So the zoo actually has a lot of things. It's got a reptile house, it's got a bird house, it's got the safari area, it has the rainforest. It's got a whole lot of different sections and actually a whole lot of different animals. Sadly, however, because of time, I'm not going to be able to show you all of those. This place actually closes at six. That's relatively early. And we weren't expecting that early, as well as I'm filming a different video for a different company. I just didn't have time to go to all those places today. But I will definitely do it another day, because I love animals. That's something special about me. Animals are my favorite things. But now, it is actually time to go see something here at the very end of the zoo. Something we've been wanting to see the whole time. Are you ready? Check it out. It's five o'clock right now. They have closed the penguin exhibit super early at 4.30. What? <laughs> okay, well that was the thing I was most excited to see when I came here, to see some penguins. See, right here. Penguin house. Closed. No penguins for today. <laughs> oh no. I'm sorry, Kai. Okay, well, I guess we'll have to come back another day for the penguins. Um, we only had a few hours here, but we did see a lot of things. We're going to make our way out, see some other things, and then I might be telling you guys what my favorite animal is. Let's head on. Taipei Zoo does have a little shuttle train that takes you from the very front of the zoo, which is more near the pandas, and then takes you all the way up to the very end by the penguins. However, we will not be using that today because the line to use it is just incredibly long. I mean, I'm talking like over 200 people. People were waiting for over like 30 to 40 minutes when you could just spend that time walking back and forth and back and forth. So I feel like with a line that big, it would just be a waste of time and energy. Just take that. But anyways, if you did want to use it, there is one, but I will not be using that because walking is good for you and you get more time. Okay guys, I had such a blast today here at the zoo in Taipei City. Now, I didn't get to see a whole lot of stuff. I didn't even get to show you most of what's here, mainly because of time, the amount of people I came during Zhong Chotia weekend and the rain. But I did actually go see lots of fun things and uh, I just want to spend just a minute giving thanks to all the beautiful animals that we saw today. What is your favorite animal to see here at the zoo? There's lots of them, so let me know. I also didn't give you a chance to tell you my favorite animal, which sadly wasn't here today. That would be a red panda. I think they're so cute, fluffy, and they are just a wonderful animal. Well, I highly recommend people to come to this place. Great to bring your family, your friends, as well, it's very convenient. It's just right off the brown line on the MRT. It's really close to lots of things. 
there's lots of things to do, lots of food. Just don't come on a day that's really, really packed. Um, you can also use your little uh, MRT card to get right in, your uh, yo-yo car. And that's also really convenient. This place isn't too big, so you won't use too much of your time when coming here. And it's just a fun place. So just remember, I want to know what your favorite animal is here. Also, I'm excited that I can tour around Taipei. We're going to do some fun things. I want to see a whole lot more. Taipei is a city that I don't know too well, as I live in Jianghua City. Well, if you're new, hit that subscribe button. I go lots of places. I want to take you with me. And I think you guys all know the drill. Until next time, I'll see you in Taipei.